you, while we're sitting here, let the smoke roll, I thought I'd take a quick second, just kind of show you guys this Oklahoma Joe's Bronco barrel smoker and let you know how it works. So you got the barrel smoker, meat here, you got the firebox down there, you got a damper in between there that helps to block the direct heat. Here is your intake air damper. You can adjust that. And then here is your exhaust up here as well. So that's the only place the air flows through this. You just adjust it here. It goes to the bottom of the smoker, as you can see the tube. It goes to the bottom of the smoker. And then it comes in the bottom of that. And then the uh, charcoal pan sits in an ash pan that's corrugated with holes all around it and allows that airflow to come through. So it just goes in, airflow goes in, the bottom comes back out the top. And you can control how much air you get coming in from here and how much goes out from there. Typically on these barrel smokers, you like to go ahead and run the exhaust open. Uh, the reason for that is it allows for the uh, the smoke to get on out of there and not to build up a bad smoke in there. And every once in a while you need to open up these barrel smokers and burp them. Just let the, the big plume of smoke come out. So excellent, excellent cookers. Uh, you can set them, you don't have to babysit it. And uh, they just do a phenomenal job. So I typically, like all kinds of smokers, but I recommend if you're kind of like that, definitely add a barrel smoker to your arsenal. Or if you're new starting out, a barrel smoker would be good as well because it's easy to maintain, manage, and, and cook with. So hope you guys enjoy the tutorial and uh, we'll be back soon. Happy smoking. <music>